friends welcome to our digital today we are going to discuss about the Hadoop uh, software installation so here we are going to install Cloudera kickstart VM okay so whoever uh, want to do practice in personal laptops you people can do same setup so all the installation related links I will provide uh, in the description section okay so Hadoop software installation main we are uh, going to install only a uh, cloud era quickstart vm installation so in this generally we have to install five softwares one is we need putty and the second one winscp or a uh, file jilla we have to download and third one vm player or uh, workstation we have to download and uh, fourth one now uh, order uh, start uh, so now we'll install one by one now okay so here first uh, we need uh, putty so putty i will install so here download and uh, here we can see you can download put it here right so once you go there here we have tar file so whether you can download install installer or you can download a tar file also okay so i am installing a tar file so tar file successfully are downloaded so here i have put it okay and next software WinSAP. So WinSAP also we can uh, uh, download. Okay, so here WinSAP download. Okay, so downloads. Downloads. So here we just uh, go down and uh, here download a uh, win scp okay so here it is downloading okay so coming to next one vm player or workstation okay vm player or workstation so here vm player vm player uh, download okay download vm workstation player so here i'm just a uh, uh, downloading uh, latest uh, vm player so here we have download option download now so this also started downloading okay so this one also downloaded so, so now last one cloud era quick start vm okay so this one i have one uh, uh, download uh, link okay so using that link uh, we have to uh, download okay so this is the uh, download uh, link okay so what we have to do here directly we have to i enter that uh, URL in the Chrome or your uh, uh, browser, okay, and then click automatically, it will start uh, downloading, okay. So, here it is a uh, uh, downloading, okay. So, generally, it will take uh, some time for downloading because of uh, 5.4 GB size, okay. So, we have successfully copied uh, all the softwares in uh, one folder. Now we'll install one by one. So first uh, we'll uh, install putty. Okay, now I'm installing uh, putty. Just we have to click next, next, and then install. Yeah, so we have successfully installed uh, putty. 
okay and next we'll see how to install a, a WinSCP okay so here we have a WinSCP just we have to double click click yes button okay so successfully installed a win scp also next we will install vm player okay so we have to click on next next buttons click next button and then install so VM workstation installation also successfully completed okay now cloud era okay so this one already zip file so just we have to unzip okay we have to unzip so extract all yeah so we have unzipped the cloud era kickstart vm okay now we'll uh, set up uh, cloud era kickstart vm okay so here first uh, we have to open vm player okay we installed vm player right uh, that we have to uh, open okay so for free for non-commercial okay so time being we'll use a free only and then finish okay so vm player we open so inside this vm player we have to open now uh, that a cloud era quick start uh, unzip file okay so here open virtual mission or create new virtual mission so we have to select to open virtual mission okay so go to that particular folder so here this is the unzip file so go inside this and again inside this and select this one okay so but here for kickstart vm we have to this for cloudera kickstart vm we have to give minimum 6 gb ram okay even some laptops if you give 6 gb ram it will be very slow but generally uh, 8 gb we have to give so here i will give 8 gb okay go here and uh, just uh, here uh, we can increase uh, uh, 4 to uh, 8 gb okay 4 to 8 gb and number of processors also instead of one i'm selecting two processors and then click ok okay now here play virtual mission we have to click play virtual mission so who all are, uh, are doing setup first time so this will take uh, a two three minutes uh, time so cloud era quick start vm successfully open okay so basically here inside this vm we have linux operating system on top of linux operating system all the hadoop related softwares uh, installed okay so now how to access this vm how to access this uh, hadoop cluster from our uh, laptop okay so for that first we should know this particular uh, mission related uh, ip address so open in terminal so here we have to execute uh, a Linux commander. Okay, so this is the IP address for uh, this particular uh, uh, VM. Okay, so let me uh, copy that IP address. So I copied that IP address. So here I'm um, opening a putty in our uh, 
local uh, laptop so i'm entering uh, here uh, ip address so this is the ip address i'm uh, saving i'm saving as a, a cloud era okay so now just i'm uh, opening so now what i'm doing basically from my windows mission to cloud era or hadoop software i am connecting okay so i accept so here username and password we have to give so username cloud era and password also cloud era okay so successfully i connected a cloud era so from here you can execute your hadoop commands or all hadoop related code you can execute here okay so this is about the hadoop software installation so next session will uh, discuss about uh, hdfs model related uh, commands thanks for watching this session bye bye